Governor Reynolds said she's planned to lift more of the restrictions she put in place earlier this spring, but just minutes ago she announced she was delaying that decision until tomorrow. KCCI's Chris Gothner just wrapped up the governor's announcement, and you asked her a direct question, Chris. What did she say? Well, she said she's still looking at the data, Rhea. You noticed that you noted that she uh, said yesterday that she would be announcing lifting some of those restrictions. Well, like you said, that has been pushed back until tomorrow. The current restrictions do expire on Friday. It comes amid an announcement of more than 500 new cases and 18 additional deaths from COVID-19. Here's what the governor says about the delay in announcing those uh, liftings of the restrictions. The Take a listen. I'm still reviewing some information with the Department of Public Health and my team today and will be announcing the new changes tomorrow. I know that Iowans and businesses are eager to know what's next, but as I've said all along, these decisions must be made carefully and driven by data. So I asked the governor what specific data points led her to make that delay today. She says with the restrictions only expiring Friday, she says there's no hurry to lift those right now. Now she wanted, she said she wanted another day, of course, to review that data. Now the governor also announced today a new test Iowa site that will be opening this weekend in Storm Lake. She also announced a new state FEMA grant program for crisis counseling. We'll have much more beginning on KCCI 8 News at 5, but for now, live at the Statehouse, Chris Gopner, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.